Have you ever pondered the enigma of the Antichrist? The term sparks intrigue, mystery, and often fear. But what is an Antichrist, really? In the realm of theology, the Antichrist is not an atheist nor a pagan. The Antichrist is an individual who preaches a gospel, but not the true gospel. They present a different gospel. As stated in the second book of Corinthians, for if someone comes to you and preaches a Jesus other than the Jesus we preached, or if you receive a different spirit from the one you received, or a different gospel from the one you accepted, you put up with it easily enough. For such men are false apostles, deceitful workmen, masquerading as apostles of Christ. Jesus himself warned the church about these counterfeit prophets. In the book of Matthew he cautioned, Beware of the false prophets who come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly are ravenous wolves. He further stated, Not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven, but he who does the will of my Father who is in heaven will enter. This reveals that even those who claim to be Christians who perform signs and miracles are not guaranteed a place in the kingdom of heaven if they disregard God's holy law. Furthermore, Jesus warned that in the period leading up to his second coming, antichrists would attempt to impersonate him, claiming to be the returned Messiah. In Matthew, it is written, Watch out that no one deceives you, for many will come in my name, claiming I am the Christ, and will deceive many. He advised that if anyone tells you, Look, here is the Christ, or there he is, do not believe it. To summarize, antichrists are not blatant non-believers. They are individuals who preach a different gospel, masquerading as apostles of Christ. They may even perform miracles and claim to be the returned Messiah, but they are deceivers, leading people astray with their false teachings. It's crucial to stay vigilant and discerning, to recognize these false prophets for what they are. The true path to the kingdom of heaven is through fulfilling the will of the Father, not through hollow claims and deceitful miracles. So remember, in the words of Jesus, watch out that no one deceives. Thank you.